Joe, and welcome back to the Joe's Hungry Channel located in my semi-adopted hometown of Fairmount, Georgia. Thank you everybody for subscribing. Thank you for watching my videos. A special shout out goes to Samantha. Thank you for bringing this to my attention because today we're gonna check out Arby's new Hush Puppy breaded fish strips. The three piece order of premium pollock strips are battered and crispy Hush Puppy coating and fried until golden brown. Served with a cup of tartar dipping sauce. The three piece order weighs in at 302 calories. I have the stats on the screen and in the description below. The three piece order will cost you $4.29. The five piece will cost you $6.29 before taxes in Georgia. And you can make each one of those a meal by adding $3. And these prices may vary when you roll through your individual drive through According to Arby's, the three piece individual order should weigh in at 3.91 ounces. And that calculates out to a very pricey $1.10 an ounce. The five piece is supposed to weigh in at 6.49 ounces and that calculates out to another pricey 97 cents an ounce. We won't be able to verify any of that till later in the video when we do the Joe is Hungry weight test. So let's get fishing and jump on over to Arby's in Calhoun, Georgia. Welcome to Arby's, may I take your order? Could I get three orders of three Hush Puppy breaded chicken strip? Okay, that was three orders of three Chicken, uh, fish sticks? Yeah. Would there be anything else today? No, ma'am. Your title is 1281. Please go forward. I've got my fish strips. Let's pull off the side and do the Joe's Hungry temperature test. Fish strip number one comes in at 171.3 degrees Fahrenheit. Fish strip number two comes in at 186.4 degrees Fahrenheit. Fish strip number three comes in at a scorching 189.7 degrees Fahrenheit. That's hot. That is definitely cooked to order. There was no question that they wouldn't cook it to order. They have the best crew at the Arby's here in Calhoun, Georgia. So they win the Joe is Hungry temperature test. So now it's time for a little more in-depth evaluation. So let's head on back to the studios and do the Joe is Hungry weight test. Hush Puppy breaded fish strips number one comes in at 3.85 ounces. Hush Puppy breaded fish strips number two comes in at 3.90 ounces. Hush Puppy breaded fish strips number three weighs in at 4.10 ounces. You add them all up, average them out, and they come out to almost exactly what Arby's says they should weigh. So they pass the Joe is Hungry weight test. And I also said in the beginning of the video that sometimes they'll charge you a different price when you roll through your individual drive-through, and that held true today. They only charged me $3.99 for a three-piece order, and that recalculates out to a slight more reasonable one dollar and two cents an ounce so now it's time for the joe is hungry big reveal <laughs> This is what they look like, and this is what they're supposed to look like. This is what they look like, and this is what they're supposed to look like. We saw how much they were, we saw what they look like, and they're still hot and crispy thanks to my heated carrying case. So that only leaves one more test, and that would be the Joe is Hungry bite test. So it is bite test, engage. <laughs> is very crunchy. It's got that hush puppy flavor. Maybe lacks a little bit of seasoning, but I think everything lacks seasoning. The tartar sauce 
is very tangy. It sort of has a bit of heat in the background. The fish doesn't appear to be minced and has a nice fish flavor. They put the tartar sauce right next to the fish in the package. That kind of makes it warm up. It's better served cold. Would I order this again someday? Probably. As far as value, I think it's a little bit pricey, but then in today's environment, what isn't? Now it's time to give this thing a score. If you don't know my scale, my scale is one to 10, nine being the best. Anything above nine is a once a lifetime experience and almost never achieve five and down is a slippery slope to food hell. So let's go ahead and give this thing the number that it really deserves. I'm gonna have to go with a six. Dot seven. That's not a bad number. This isn't a bad snack, although a little bit overpriced. That is my number. That is my review. And we will see you in the next video.